All right, another unboxing. So uh, I have an upcoming project. I'm going to do a series of videos, and uh, by numerous requests from viewers. So I figure, well, I better get back on it. Um, so I had to order this tool. Well, I would call it a tool um, in order to do these upcoming videos. So stay tuned for these. I'm, I don't want to really let the cat out of the bag, so to speak, right yet on what I'm going to do. And of course, made in China. Of course, I knew that. So anyway, I've got to do some measurements for some range testing. Oh, I did let the cat out of the bag. Not only did I let the cat out of the bag, I let the measuring thingy out of the bag. So here's the deal. Uh, Oh, isn't that nice? So, I'll leave a link to this down below. But, years ago, um, I was doing some range testing. Uh, and I needed to get one of these roller wheels. Because I was tired of doing it with a tape measure. So, I thought I'd make it a little easier on myself. And get one of these wheels. So, I ordered like a $20 wheel off Amazon. And it broke uh, the second time I took it out. And it was very cheap and uh, low quality. Of course, I only paid 20 bucks for it. So that being said, um, I think I paid closer to 40 for this one. And um, so we're going to see how the... I don't know how you pronounce that. I'm going to go with Zozen. Anyway, so that'll be kind of interesting. And people were saying that these break. So, well, I'm going to use it, put it through its paces. If it breaks, I'll just send it back. That's one of the reasons why I like to buy stuff on Amazon. I'm not really particularly a fan of Dr. Evil. However, I do like they, um, the way that uh, they have their return policy set up. It's just basically a no haggle, no questions asked type deal. So I really like that. Anyway, so I'll leave a link to this down below. I might even do a review on this while I'm out setting up my my testing so I'll kill two birds with one stone um, but yeah that looks pretty interesting it's kind of a fake hard rubber here I like the uh, the old school um, mechanical uh, unit here I don't know what you call that but anyway all right stay tuned